What is going on guys? I'm here in the booth today for a beautiful game of baseball and they're just, you know, setting up this uh, field and all that fun stuff. But what I'm going to do today is show you how we set up our mixer right here, our broadcast device. So, um, here we have the scorecard. This is what just a basic setup for this is our setup. This is what um, WKJQ radio uses for their high school baseball um, setups. So, here's what we do um, we have the remote mix sport um, JK audio here. The really important thing. And here comes the baseball team, by the way. Got a little bit sad. Anywho, but this is what we carried in. Q97.3 FM. Listen to us. Um, so, like I said, here's the remote mix sport JK audio. Now, here we have the plugins. So we have mic one, mic two, headphone one, headphone two, headphone three, mic three as well. Um, and then you have the volume control and all that stuff. So um, this is the mixtape where we play our commercials in between innings. Um, and I'll show you how to use that sometime in the future. Um, so we have this and we plug it into mic one. And lay that out to the side right here. So, plug up one. Then we have the headphones here. And this is pretty self explanatory what these do. You plug the mic portion into mic two. Now, with the remote, uh, the remote mix sport, it does not work unless you um, let me get this in here first before I explain there we go and you also plug the headphone portion of the headphones into headphone one because there's nothing to plug into so so your if you do have a commercial mix uh, mix device a commercial playing device then this is the Sony um, Psych. But if you have, it will not work unless you have it plugged in to mic one. And, but the headphones will work into mic two, even though if you have the headphones into um, headphone one, it'll still work just fine. Um, and if you have a second person, which is, I'm gonna have, my broadcasting partner uh, with me. You plug his into, or she, whoever, whatever it may be. Um, for me, it's a he, but you're, I'm gonna plug his into mic three. And then I'm going to plug his headphones into, get it untangled from the thing. Come on, walk with me. Why is it so tangled up? This is so unfortunate. Okay, finally, I think I got it, yeah. All right, and then you go plug his into headphone two. So, I'm gonna get his headphones out of the way. Now, important thing, especially with the remote mix, you need a cell phone, because without the cell phone, you call the station, and then that's how they put it on air. Otherwise, it would not get put on air. So we have our cell phone here, and you here's the cool cord, and, we'll, and it will not work. The cord will not work unless it has this on there. I don't know why. I don't know what the proper term for it is called, but it won't work unless you have that. And then you plug it into the phone mix. As you can see, it says it right there, and it is connected right here. So you plug that in, and then the uh, 
headphone portion of the mic where you would plug headphones into your phone. I actually do not think Kong Sysol had a headphone plug-in, but whatever. You, okay, if this would stick, okay, I'm just gonna lay it right there. Look how handy I am. And use this part to plug it into the headphone portion. Now, after you've made sure everything's plugged in, um, you should have your setup here. I'll back up and show you the setup. And um, the phone also has interference sometimes, so you may want to, for us anyway, we'd have to move it around to not let that interference go over air, you know, the little da 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 da, -da thing. So, um, and here you have the volume control for your commercials. And then you have the volume controllers for your microphones on your headphones. And I don't know what these do. But uh, there's your battery test and our battery is good because it's giving us a strong good red light. If it's like real fidgety and all that stuff, it means you got a bad battery. Um, but as you can see, ours is good. So we good though. Um, I thought somebody was talking to me. I was like, what? Um, anywho, so this is our, pretty much our setup um, that WKJQ uses for the baseball games, which is what I'm a partner in broadcasting. So, um, it's a quick little blog, the really quick little blog basically to show you um, how to set up the remote mix sport. Um, um, if you have any questions, just leave a comment down below and I'll try to get to it. Um, so yeah, um, please comment, like, subscribe, and I love you guys and God bless.